Representative Erica Thomas, and I was a foster child. With my mom, I forgive her, you know, and the reason why I do is because I feel like she went through a lot. She went through a lot, and I don't even know if I would have been able to go through everything that she went through and still be sane. There were some good homes that said, I really want to help Erica. I want to help her repair the relationship she has with her parents. I want to make sure that she's successful. And I think that it takes that one good home to transform a foster kid's life. So you know what I decided? I decided to go live because I'm very upset because people are getting really out of control with this. With this white privilege stuff. I'm at the grocery store and I'm in the tin out, the out that says 10 items or less. Yes, I have 15 items, but I'm not much pregnant and I can't stand up for long. And this white man comes this white man comes up to me and says, you lazy son of a bitch. He says, you lazy son of a bitch. You need to go back where you came from. And he says that. I said, sir, you don't even know me. I'm not lazy. I'm not much pregnant. He says, you're ignorant. You're ignorant. And I'm not, And it hurt me so bad. I'm sorry, y'all, because everything in me wanted to just tell him I'm who I am and, and how I don't. But I couldn't. I couldn't get anything out. I could just tell him, please leave me alone, please. And my child is just sitting right there. He said, Mama, why we call you that? Why we do that? I can't even explain to her why he has so much hate in his heart 